Hello everybody, my name is Palm and welcome to, welcome back to my channel. Please ignore my busted up look today. I'm in the middle of washing my hair. Then I realized that this is very much ample time to record a new video. So it's just like, you know what? Why not? Let's just do it. I have looked worse. <laughs> if you've been here for a while, you know I've looked worse. So today um, we're gonna check out the amazing digital circus the pilot episode i think i got I think someone recommended me this one but it's by the same studio that did murder drones glitch productions and i watched the first episode of murder drones like two years ago i do plan on watching the other episodes but i do need to catch up on the first episode first before i jump into the second episode because i don't remember anything that happened so but yeah i want to check this one out because the premise sounds really cool so in the description of the video, it says the amazing digital circus is a psychological dark comedy about cute cartoon characters who hate their lives and want to leave. And honestly, that sounds like a fun time. So I thought, why not check it out? And uh, if you guys want me to watch more episodes, you guys, you let me know. Uh, I'm going to try this thing out where I kind of like react to the first episode and then see how it goes. And honestly, see if I like it as well, too. So I'll react to the first episode, and if you guys want more, you guys let me know and I'll react to more. But, without further ado, let's get into this video. I have not recorded in such a long time, I hope everything works well. Welcome to the amazing Digital Circus! My name is Kane, I'm your ringmaster, and I'm here to show you the most jaw-dropping, heart-stopping, mind-bending paraphernalia you've ever laid your eyes upon! Isn't that right, Bubble? That's right, Kane! I can't wait to see what you've got cooking up <laughs> So let's not waste time. Let's get right into the show! Wait, hold on. All right, I'm gonna do subtitles. I actually been meaning to always do subtitles. Keep forgetting. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I saw that little glitch happen. Guess we're not leaving. <laughs> There's some interesting circus Kane, creatures. Is this one of your NPCs or is this a new sucker? Because if it's a new character, we're gonna have to redo this whole theme song. <laughs> I'm not doing that again. My my! It okay. appears a new human has entered this realm. How do I take this? <laughs> oh oh I wouldn't do that. <laughs> Oh, I've uh, ooh. They're humans. I well, that's scary. I put on some weird headset and now I'm here. Wait, is this some SC SAO type situation? Why can't I take it off? Wait, I love that. Let's just try to calm I love it. It's going to be okay, new stuff. I don't think so. We've all been through this. You just need to get your head to What the Oh, no cursing. No, 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 my dear. We can't have any of that foul <laughs> language around here. The amazing digital circus is a place to be enjoyed by all ages. You, my friend, stumbled into an incredible world of wonders where anything can happen. No, I love the no cursing because YouTube will love the no cursing. Oh, she's going to try it anyways. Honestly, I, I, I get it. Gotta test it out. Oh, my God. Uh, well, how do I, you know... Leave. Leave. <laughs> uh, well, don't freak out about it or anything, but I think uh, anybody we freak don't out exactly you know can't. how to leave. Shut up, Jax. But yeah, he's right. Welcome to your new home. Oh God. Your new body. Oh God. New home? What do you mean? I think I would I freak out. Mean... We've been stuck here for years. Oh my goodness. Kinger over there supposedly been here the longest. Did someone say something about an insect? Years? Should... I'm hey, curious what happens to their bodies then. <laughs> it's like an SAO type situation where their like bodies are just like dehydrating. Oh, she's freaking out. Oh, okay. Now I get it. Oh. This is a dream. Yeah. And I you gotta go through the whole entire denial process. Right now we're in 
denial still. Whatever you say, kid. They broke my comedy mask. But uh, yeah, I, I wonder. I wonder what happens to their bodies, their human bodies. Because is it like an SEO type situation where like if their bodies die, like they die? All sorts of other activities. These activities may include. Oh. Ball pits, mini golf, Pretty cool. And more. So what's the... <laughs> I wonder what those other activities are. Drown yourself in the digital lake or engage in <laughs> <ridery> <laughs> at the digital carnival. Just take yourself out. Night, day, it's all okay. The choice is yours. A cosmic buffet. Is that all there is? Of course not. This is the... the Oh. We don't venture out into the void. Not even I know what's out there. <laughs> I mean, we stay why right not here, I explore it then? I like. Oh. Seeing eyes on you. Okay, calm down. I would explore the void. That seems like a potential exit. Get out of here before the moon gets frisky. Wait, what's that? Oh. Whoa. I saw that. Wait, wait, wait. wait. I saw that exit door. Oh, that's gross. Why are you like this? <laughs> Wait, wait, was that an exit door I saw out there? Yeah, I saw it too. To leave? What exit? If there was a way to leave, I'm pretty sure we'd have all left by now. Yeah, what are you talking about? There's an exit door, guys. There is literally an exit door. Uh, I assure you, there <laughs> is no magical exit door. But there probably is. probably just experiencing digital hallucinations from your mind's transition to the digital plane. Uh, I swear I saw Digital hallucinations! Oh, he knows. How about we talk about something else? He knows okay. about that door, but oh, but I have, but why haven't the others figured out that? Uh, oh, God. oh, why can't I remember my if that, name? If that door has always been there, why haven't they figured it out? The digital circus. One of the few things I don't have control over are your minds. So all I can help you with is coming up with a new one. Uh, what's my name? Don't you worry your <laughs> Yeah, I mean, there's no point. Can be anything. And they gotta get that TOS in there. I don't care, just pick anything. Let's see. Oh, don't, don't do that. You could have something like really terrible. What do you think of? Yeah. You're right, terrible. No. Let's try that again. Girl, just pick something for yourself. What do you think of Pomni? Uh, sure. I think I, I mean, it's got half of my name in there. We should have a brand new adventure for Pretty our good. new member, Pomni. said that like five minutes ago. You! Do you like He's now my new favorite character. Now the same name? Okay. Sort of. You parasite! Uh, I don't really Since know. you're new around here, we're gonna make it a simple in-house adventure to warn There's so many things going on. There's right so many here. things going on. I have so many thoughts. Hi. I'm gonna try and save them to the end, because just like... Don't worry, Zubal. I'll make it something unobtrusive that you can still choose to not get involved with. Today's adventure is... Gather the Gloinks! <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. That's right. The entire circus tent will be infested mm. with Gloinks. Okay, I'm not. you got to catch them all. What, what are Gloinks? I'm glad you asked, Bubble. They're small. And what do they do? They... How do they... Oh my goodness. Are small, mischievous critters that steal anything and everything they run into. Why do these humanoid hash browns do this? How do you stop them? That's for you to find out. Oh wow, now, thanks. Good luck and have fun, my little superstars. Thanks for telling us nothing. What did any of that mean? Oh, that's just one of Kane's little adventures. They're just something fun to do to, you know. Rebenna's Keep right. you from going insane, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Speak for yourself. If anyone needs me, then f off. Oh god, oh please help! Oh. Oh, god. oh, well? Oh no, they killed Zubal. <laughs> anyway, you guys wanna go get something to eat? Oh wait, we should go check on Kofmo. I'm pretty sure he'd like to meet Pony. My impenetrable fortress! You want to come with us to check on Kofmo? No, not really. I think Kofmo's gone insane. Last time I spoke with him, he was rambling endlessly about some exit. 
What? Kind of like you, Pomni. You might be going insane too. No, there, but wait, there, wait. there is an exit. Wouldn't that more likely mean the exit does exist? Yes. Could also mean you just have a jump start and losing your mind. Why are these guys so opposed well, about an exit? I'd like to ask him about it. Uh, if this was real, which it isn't, because it's a dream. <laughs> she still thinks this is a dream. Okay, the denial phase uh, takes a long time to get like over. That. I'm fine with doing whatever, as long as I get to see funny things happen to people. Okay, I've already had enough of these things. <sighs> you? He's so cynical. I really like him Tommy actually. Go check on Kafmo, which leaves Crybaby and Hoo Ha together to go handle the Zubal situation. <laughs> do you think pairing them up together is a good idea? Of course I do. They're the two most mentally stable and capable characters to be paired together. Come um, on, ladies. Let's uh, go harass the clown. That was a that was sarcastic, right? I think he was being sarcastic. The mask is broken again. Ah! Oh! Gangle, you startled me. So, this is where we all live. Or, well, where we all sleep at night. Even though we don't really need to sleep, it's sometimes nice to kind of take a break from everything oh. and have a bit of a routine, you know? Doorbell. I'm sure there will be one for... Oh, look. You already got one. I still don't understand about the adventures. Why even go on them at all? Why not try to find a way to leave? Well, we usually do when we first arrive, but... After a while, you start to realize yeah, that it comes... you really can't leave, and constantly chasing an unattainable goal will start driving you a bit crazy. And eventually, yeah. you get to asking what the point of anything is, and you completely oh God. lose sight of who you are and why you're even alive. And when you reach your breaking point, something really terrible can happen. Like you have? I do something like you reach your breaking point. Uh, but that's not something we need to deal with today. Above anything else, the adventures give us something to do that keeps our minds healthy and stimulated. Right. Thank goodness this it is looked like they're doing a good job. Oh my goodness. He's not taking this well. Why are we here again? What are we doing? We're getting one of our friends. To be fair, I wouldn't be taking this well either. I'd probably go quickly insane. Huh. Maybe he's not in his room? I hope he's alright. Don't worry. Maybe don't he face. took the exit. Uh, wait, well, why? You, you, you shouldn't have keys to anyone's room. Nah, I've got keys everywhere, and you've all been fine. By the way, I may have left something in your room today, so let me know if you find it. Uh, you're not afraid of centipedes, are you? Jax! That's literally my only fear. Why would you do this? What? It could be a completely unrelated question. You'll never know until it's too late. Oh, God. Oh. Oh. <sighs> What is that? I've been looking for this. Thanks for keeping an eye on it, Coffee. I'm gonna head out. See ya. Oh! Coffee's been obstructed. That, that's okay. What does that mean? Is that... Uh, it might be that terrible thing I was talking about earlier when you reach your breaking point. Oh. Okay, wait. Maybe there's still time to fix him before we get Kane. <laughs> I know we didn't always get along. You should probably you run and stop talking. Laughing at your jokes. I swear I really did think they were funny. I was just having a bit of a bad day. Oh no. Well, she can't die, so I think she'll be fine. Hey, Pommy. Oh. Thank you. Help me out here. I understand that you don't want to go. Oh, I don't think that's a good idea, Pomni. I'm sorry, but you're gonna have to leave this girl. I'm sorry! Yeah, honestly. Sorry. Yeah. It's not worth it. Oh. Is her hand stuck like that forever? Oh, she is a nice gal. Going I back. Know what I'm looking at here. We saw Gloin carry one of Zubel's pieces down there. Remember? Oh yeah. Thank you for the recap. <laughs> Boy, we're not very good at this, are we? 
<laughs> That's okay. Uh, sup, uh, fellas? Jax! We found the Zubal hole. Go. Cool. Uh, How is Kofmo doing? I hope he's not still mad at me for not laughing at his jokes. Oh, he's doing great. In fact, I don't think I've ever seen him this happy before. Well, it's good to know he hasn't completely lost his mind. Well, about that. You guys are also standing way too close to that hole. Yeah, saw that coming. Oh. Is that an insect collection? I think it's a nest. <laughs> Hello, <laughs> Jesus. Uh, Ragatha, that was your name, right? <laughs> oh, she is messed up. <laughs> hey, look, I'm I didn't mean to leave you behind like that. Yeah, I you did, and I think that's a okay. Look at my hand. It's okay. I mean, you... what you need to do right now is find Jane. He'll be able to fix me up and take care of Kokomo. Oh, she is glitching oh, out. Okay, but where can I find him? Uh, I really know. Look around. Well, that's not helpful. Uh, okay, I'll get him. You just stay right there. Not that you can really move or anything. Uh, just hang in there. I'll be right back. I promise. Cool. Oh, so funny. I'm sorry. Your, your first day here had be so terrible. It was terrible either way. Uh, yeah. Well, don't worry about it. Yeah, like. I'm just gonna go get. Kevin. Regardless of any of the stuff that happened, this would have been a terrible day. <laughs> I think Kane wants to go take care of that exit. He looked a little worried. Oh. That's not ominous at all. Oh my god. I'm curious, can they feel pain? They say like ow and ouch, I'm wondering if they can actually feel anything. Run, girl, run. Oh, is that who you are? You know, you could have asked for my consent before forcing me to see something so completely and utterly <laughs> disgusting. This guy is... How despicable! A rabbitoid that runs its mouth in the presence of my royal figure! Well, as a royal myself, I would like to... Alright, Jawa the Hutt. Oh, look, there's Zubal. Hi, Zubal. Ah, uh, help me, you idiot! Kinda rude, Zubal. Now I don't want to help you. Oh, I always lose. Yes! <laughs> Oh, brother. Hey, King, are you mother? <laughs> so your hands are don't even really work. Oh no. Ooh, she doesn't see what she looked like yet. That's going to be an existential crisis later. Well, that didn't help at all. In the barrel, in the barrel, in the barrel, in the barrel.
Exit. Enter the exit. Leave. Oh! I didn't think they would actually open. Oh, is it like... Oh, what's well, not... I thought it's not endless loop. <gasps> oh, no. It's a maze. Interesting, it's a maze. Do you not realize that everything must be Gloix? I am Gloix. You will be Gloix. God will be Gloix. This is dumb and weird. Well, but even yet, you're still watching. I don't know if anything this queen is saying has any merit. If I can, like, pay attention to it. <laughs> Saying that like, everything must be glowing, so you'll eventually become okay. glowing. You didn't experience a game show in there, did you? Uh, I. What are you talking about? Oh, <laughs> boss battle time! What's happening? It's just Kofmo. Don't worry about it. Kofmo abstracted? Nah, he's fine. You're right. How are we gonna get out of here? Guys, over there. How does she turn back, then? I guess you have to find Kane. First. No, wait, why would I say that? <laughs> oh, rude. Wait, yeah, Hunter's just not even here? take the escalator. This whole thing for her? Be quiet. I can't hear the escalator. I mean, you'll find somewhere eventually. Every every door is different. The back rooms. <laughs> is this worse, or was the other place <laughs> where she at was worse? Pick your poison. Ooh, this place is a lot bigger. Hold on, let's let's look around for a second. Oh my goodness, she's really losing it. I don't understand the going crazy part. I, like... I mean, like, the, like, as in, like, this is not gonna help us. Going crazy is gonna do the opposite effect. Oh, she's in the void! I will say the music in here is really good. The core... She's had a terrible day. Like, this is the worst day of her life. <laughs> oh, what are they doing? You always know how to make me say this exact sentence. Yes! I'm alert on my wacky watch at this hour? Oh no! Someone's venturing out into the void! <laughs> They'll get totally spoiled! Hmm? What does that mean? Followed by what? Oh. There you go. Now what the heck happened around here? Oh yeah, my doing. Kane. Kafka went through a scroll. Scroll doesn't they'll see something that extracted. they're not supposed to. Kafka abstracted. Why didn't anybody tell me? Just yet. you were freaking gone. Um, this guy's. And into the cellar you go. Oh, with the rat others. Man, I can't believe Kofmo just gave up like that. I mean, no offense, Kinger, but I always thought you would be next. Oh, she in turn to one that was just her head. Gotcha. I am in so much pain! Oop. So I don't think Kofmo gave up. I think he was literally trying to figure out a way out of here. I do have to apologize for lying about the exit. 
I knew how much all of you have been wanting there to be one, but, you know, I was having so much trouble figuring out what to put on the other side and ended up never quite finishing it. Well, that's just, and that's you know, an a-hole thing I to do. Like letting people see my unfinished work, especially if it leads you out into the void. Anyway, looks like you defeated the Gloit Queen, so I guess the adventure's over. Your that is, is a such digital feast cooked by our an a whole thing to do. I know you guys have been wanting to leave here, so I made this fictional exit to get you guys excited to go nowhere. That's so messed up. But she's gone. She is just... Her mind is gone. Gone. I mean, I get it. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah. Yeah. She's gone crazy. She's lost it. Interesting. The board is like the digital space, the digital realm. I wonder if there's any way outside. Like, I'm assuming... I would assume probably the void, it's like the only way out of there. That's probably like their best chance to get out of there is like through the void. But I, I don't know. But I, I don't know how that works. But it depends though. Excuse me. It depends though if this is like an SAO type situation where like their bodies are still there. Are their bodies still there or not? You know what I'm saying? Like. Are they dead? Are the human bodies still dead? Can they go back to their human bodies? Is it their subconscious that's been transported into this world and their bodies are no longer cease to exist and they die? Because at that point then they can't really leave. They can't really leave from there back into the human world if they have no bodies to get back into. You know what I'm saying? And it's just their consciousness that exists in this world. Realistically speaking, that there probably is no way out of here in terms of like getting back into like the real world. I don't think that I don't think that exists. We'll just have to keep watching and find out. But I like that. That was really fun. It was really interesting. I'm sure there's a lot of like little mini Easter eggs that I missed. Um, that kind of like gave a little hint to how the rest of the season is gonna go. I did. I did find it interesting how like if you go like if you stare into the void too much, you'll get Spoiled? Like, what does spoiled mean in this context? You'll know too much, you'll learn too much, you know? That's probably what it is. Like, you'll, you'll ruin the fun! Or maybe, you know, maybe like it's information- I, I don't know. Anyways, yeah, it seems like it's just something that she's not supposed to know. You stay in there long enough, you'll- you'll- It'll lead to something that you won't know. It'll lead, it'll lead to information- It'll lead to you learning information that he clearly doesn't want you to know. And I guess if you think too hard about leaving, or it seems like it says like when you go crazy, but it seems like if you like obsess over something, if you think too hard about wanting to leave or about something that's not really related to just this place, you turn into that. You turn into the abstracted, and you turn into just a monster. Interesting. Well, clearly whoever and he Kane like he. I wonder if he's also human too. Like, I wonder if he's also like turned to if someone turned to human, because he has no control. He says no control over their minds, which is why they get abstracted, right? Like he has no control over their minds, what they think, and he he so he doesn't know anything really about them or their personal lives. He's just overseeing this like digital space. He's just an overseer of the digital space. I wonder why though. Why they forget their names? Like why is that important? Is remembering their name something that's important? Will they remember something else? Because they put on the headset and then they were transported here. That's all they remember. Clearly they have memories. I wonder if they have memories of their past lives though. I don't think they I don't think they ever explained that. 
is it just that their name that they've forgotten or that or is there other stuff that they don't they don't remember i'm curious i'm, I'm really curious if these are just like little details or do they actually mean something i don't know anyways i'm gonna stop speculating <laughs> I could probably sit here and speculate for like forever, but yeah, let me know what you guys think. Let me leave your comments and thoughts in the description down below. Let me know if you guys want to see more of this show. I'm really intrigued because I do really like the SA, like the Sword Art Online. When I say SAO, I mean Sword Art Online. It's an anime that has a very similar plot to this. Mm, they're really, really, really popular. Um, it's, it's the anime that made Isekai very popular like why we see it's got animes all the time that's it sao and i love sao regardless of what anybody has to say i love sao I love star online for good it's a really good anime um yeah anyway similar plot line um a premise of just getting stuck in like another world basically put on a headset and getting stuck in another world is it's, it's where the similarities end but very similar but i do really like that that uh that plot point that Storyline. I think it's really interesting and there's a lot of things to discover so I'm intrigued I am interested in watching another episode so you guys let me know if you guys would like to see me react to another episode of this um, and also if you guys want to see more motor drones as well too uh, re I reacted to that already like two years ago so if you guys want to go watch this on my channel uh, I will link the original video for the amazing circus this video as always it's in the link in the description down below for the original video go check it out um, on glitch productions yeah i'm this looks super cool i'm i'm yeah i'm intrigued you know, i want to see more anyways um that's gonna be it for today's video thank you so much for watching like and subscribe if you enjoyed turn on notifications to see whenever i upload a new video follow me on follow me on all my socials in the description down below to see more of my face and that's gonna be it for today's video and i'll see you next time bye